Welcome back everyone, Ziggy here. We just did some pickpocketing. If you didn't see part one, link's in the description. But we're heading off, guys, and check us out. We're pretty pimped out. We got everything going for us. We just did that in our preliminary run. And as far as everyone here is concerned in this game, we've just started at the mill. And we're running over shit. So Teresa thinks we just started. See you later there, ho. And uh, we did all that. We talked to them. And we're ready to go, guys. So this is what we were kind of looking forward to in part one. So we could be jacked up and then play the game. There's a lot of upgrades going to happen here. This is, I told you the first part was getting the stuff. The second part was upgrading. Sorry, ma'am. So just come flying in here like you own the place. Jump over Capon's horse. You're in. You're in. So we're going to try to blister through some of this because we got a long way to go. And a short time to get there. What the fudge. Son of a smurf. So head in here. And check us out, guys. What are you doing? You have no business here. Clear off. When I used to play, hey, I came in Henry. here in a green shirt and pants. Henry, who disappeared off, be that as it may. Why have you come here? I must get your sword back. So, you'd like to enter my service? So, I... Yes. So that's it, guys. We're now entering the service. So come up here. There should be a guy leaving here. There he goes. If he's down there sitting down, you're beat. You'll have to come back later. And he's going, so let's go down here. We're going to get ourselves a book. Let him go a little ways away because he's a bit of a bitch. And then get this chest. And this is how we're starting this off. Now we grab Baron's cup and everything. We're ready for business. And all you want out of here is the book, really. Take the savior snaps. What the heck? And now we've got some business. You might find Baron right around here. But if he's not, just head up. And let's see Kuntosh. Get your stamina up. Let's get our health up. So food. Let's go to our horse because we have some savior snaps. And let's get, or not save your snaps, Marigold Deconcoctions. Get those bitches in our inventory. And let's drink one of those. Now talk to Kunich. We don't even need him anymore. I see you, sir. Aren't you observed? But he's got something we want. So say, you bastard. You bastard. And then run like the Dickens. Yeah, it hurt. So I'm going to show you where you can get Kunich, your best place. Because Kunash has a bit of a phobia. New perk on our main level. So head in here. And Kunash won't come in here. For some reason. He doesn't like it in here. He's afraid. Look at So if you go over here too. And get out of his view. You can actually turn the sword silver. And drink a marigold if you need it. Just come out of swinging. Go back in if you want. Come out again. Go back in if you want. So this is your safety zone. But you may as well just take him out. Kuna's is a pretty good fighter too, by the way. If you get his back against the wall, he's going to beat you. Oh no, we got him. You let him go down. Take him out. It doesn't matter what you do, you won't get in trouble here. Because for some reason, Kunesh is open game. You can walk right by a soldier with him. And guys, I often debate this point, and I usually don't. But today, we're going to kill Kunash. I want the book. That's why we came. We fought him. We're going to kill him just to see if he ever gets resurrected. And no one will go in there, so he'll just rot away in there. How's it going, sir? Nobody's killing Kunash. So now we can move on. We've got lots of lots of stuff to do in this episode, guys. And once again, thanks for coming along. If I didn't say it, then it's not once again. It's the first time. But I appreciate everybody that comes here. Let's get everything that we can sell to him, and that's all the swords. Sword, 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 sword. Now, he won't be able to buy them all because he doesn't have enough money. I'll be with you. So let's talk trade and sell. And just sell him everything. Don't sell him your stinger, though. And then go back to the basket. 
sort by price and we need to get rid of 645 bucks so there's 500 and get rid of one of those 1k boom close the deal see you later so we can put those back because he don't want them so weapons <coughs> We're going to have to do a couple trips to sell all this stuff, but that's good. So first thing you want to do with this guy is repairs. Because all the money you spend on repairs, you can get back. So just select all. Make sure there's nothing that's junk that you're selling. Close the deal. And now it's going to have about nine grand. So just start selling them crap. If there's anything you want to keep, We'll sort it all out in the wash. So we put all the the warhorse stuff back in the chest at Teresa's. We didn't want to carry it around. So let's talk trade. He's only got two grand. I thought he had like more. Anyways, so armor. Let's sell. Well, we got that shit on. Sell him that. Sell him that. Let's get rid of some of this piddly stuff. Whatever's worth worth the least, like those, the gloves. Get rid of that. And get rid of some of this stuff. We could save the boots and stuff for the cobbler, but ain't nobody got time for that. Well, that was too much. So we got to get rid of 300 bucks. Let's go back to your basket. Same deal. Sort by price. And then get rid of right here and right here. And... That's good enough. Let him keep the extra money and you'll get double reputation. And we're a little bit top heavy here. So let's move some stuff right now. Oh, we're still super top heavy. Because I didn't start at the top. Speaking of top heavy. Okay, we're not going to sell golden spurs right yet. We're going to sell shit that's heavy, maybe. We don't need to sell the necklaces. Oh, we got that one on. I know this is taking a bit of time, but we gotta we gotta do things right. We wanna get as rid as rid of as much as possible and repair all our stuff. This is a bit of a pain in the ass, I do agree. A lot of times I will just put everything I'm wearing on the horse too, so I have more room to carry. Um oh sorry, we wanna repair first. Good health to you. Yeah, whatever. Lord watch over you. So there's only a couple items. Close the deal. Now let's talk trade. Sell. And he's only got a K armor. So let's go with the heaviest shit first. So, oh, sorry. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. And that's pretty good. Do we have anything that's worth a few bucks that we're selling? No. That's good enough. Check basket close deal. Okay, so now we'll go over and see our... This is our number one numero uno guy. Because he'll buy anything. He doesn't give you as much for it. But we're talking just a few dollars. For the convenience of one-stop shopping. So what I like to do with him is get rid of some of this stuff. That no one else wants. We don't need three bows. Um, we'll keep that. Um, I think we can get rid of that. And we can get rid of those, one of those. And then we can start getting rid of all this junk down here. Keep the armor kits. Get rid of the cloth. I usually get rid of the dice, but might might collect them this time. Always keep your spade. Okay, and we got rid of that. So we got enough stuff here. Good day to you. Because the only dice we really need are the odd dice. So let's talk trade. And then go to buy. And let's buy. An Aqua Vitalis. You'll never need a horse potion again. That's this one because we're carrying the horse buff all the time. Buy an Artisma. No, Aqua Vitalis heals wounds or helps resist wounds. Artisma is warfare and strength. This is rage. That's self-explanatory. We need a Bowman's. We have one, but we'll take another one. Buck's blood is uh, doubles your stamina. That's um, Cockroll is 20 energy. 
So you need that if you're falling asleep. Digestive, in case you can't drink any more potions. That's agility and defense. And then a full life. And a couple more of these, maybe three. And then that's it. I don't know if we bought this book. Ah, what the hell. I got tons of money. And now go to sell. And let's sell. We can sell both those. We're not selling Baron's Cup, guys. Don't sell that. So sell all this other junk. Bows, sell the cloth. These are all things those other guys won't buy. And then let's we can get rid of the shoes. Had a few pairs of those. Get rid of those. Get rid of the goblets. Ye longbow. And that's all we need to get rid of of that. So we can go to armor now. And we're already over. So let's check the basket. Sort by price. And he's only got. Six hundred and ninety-one dollars. So we need to get rid of four hundred bucks. So that's oh no, got to go down here. Four hundred bucks. So we can get rid of those. That's five pounds. So, and then he can keep the extra cash because we'll get double reputation. We'll start getting better deals. So that's all I want to sell right now. I can probably save something to sell to the next guy. Put all this stuff back on the horse. No, that's worth too much. Weapons, that's good. Other, we got Baron's Cup. We can start putting these books on the horse. If you're going to read something, try to read the uh, stolen books first. Okay, so what else we got? Let's get rid of all these potions. If you can access a potion, you can access your horse. So you can keep them all on your horse because there's no time that you can't get them. Let's keep one of those handy. And if we're going to use the Savior Schnapps, let's use the stolen one. That's it. So we got a bunch of things to do, as I said. We gotta go get Lady Stephanie's wine. There's a multitude of ways to do it. Well, let's get up there and we'll hang on. God be with you. So first thing you want from him is that book, Hercules 2. That'll come in handy. Check basket close deal. And then ask him about Stephanie's wine. And he says, Oh, I sold it to the contest. And I said, What if I don't get it? And he said, then you don't have it. And then that's it. Oh, we're out of there. So he told us where the wine was. It's at the yeah. archery contest. You just have to go up and do it. So you can come here at nighttime when he's not there. And there'll be a chest beside him. And you can just steal it out of there. Well, not beside him. Beside where he stands. Or you can do the contest and win. Or if you lose, I'll also show you another trick here. You can talk to the guy in the black. And he'll give it to you because our charisma is high enough. And if it's not, you can still buy it off him. So you just have to take a guess what target he's going to be at. Because he he could be at either one. It's random. And what you do is block the target. And then he can't shoot. But either way, you're only competing against one at a time. Good day to you. So first thing you want to do is talk trade and get his book. And that's for agility, obviously. And then tell him about the contest. And say keg of wine. And I know the rules. So now you see he's at the other one. You really only have to go against him now. But all you do is just leave. And then talk to him. My respect for you. And he'll give it to you because your Christmas is so high. Just that the one we could have beat him. And just say yeah, Lady Stephanie. And that's it. Success. Very well. So we got the wine. So now we need to get rid of a few more things. We're we're at that tipping point. Or just a book will take us over the top. We don't need 16 lockpicks. You only ever need one in your inventory at a time. And so it can be as quick as that if you want. Where'd you go? Oh, I saw you pop in there. So if you see Baron, remember, keep your eyes peeled for him. He's in red, but that's not him because he didn't have a hood. So what you want to do now is get your um, your bow up to four. You should be around two right now. So just double check it. Go to player, combat, and check your bow. You're only at one. Shit. So let's up a couple of these. So we're going to take Insomniac so we need less sleep. And then for speech, I just take Highborn. It's not a big deal, really. 
And now if you come out here, you'll get some sheep. And what you want to do, just wait, is corral them in, away from the road. So you don't get caught. And right here is fine. And just keep going until you get your bow up to four. I want to keep this in real time, so we see how long it's going to take. Ah, oh, bitch moved. So make sure you got some arrows. It's always hard to get them on an angle like this. So you got lots of sheep. So we're at two. Just keep going. You're going to have to take out this whole fleet of sheep here. Make it a better shot from over here. It's hard to do it when they're on the downhill. Try not to hit the dead ones. Or try to hit anything that's alive, not the grass. Oh man, looking pretty bad here. So weapons, let's use the 115s. We got lots of arrows anyways. We got them. It's nice when you have a cluster of them. Too high. I flinched, guys. I flinched. That's my excuse. Look at there's a whole fleet of them, and I fucking missed them all. But our bow skill is pretty low, as you can see. We are at level one, so don't expect a lot of accuracy. And the sheep are pretty fucking sensitive to you moving towards them. But this is a good place to get some extra practice in that we obviously need. So we're at two. You can actually get to three and a half or so. We got some strength. Oh, look at that. Cool. But I really recommend to get it up to four. But like I say, it's good practice. Oh, I flinched. I think he's still alive. Just about got him in the ass. That guy's feet to the left are still twirling down there. So funny. So obviously I need to practice and that's good. That's why I'm here. Get my level up and get a little bit better at the bow. I think he's down. So now if you need to reset... Put your bow away. And we'll get her up to four here. Best bets are right up here. Circle this bush. And it's a guaranteed sheep reset. Now this is important that we get to level four. I'm not just doing it for shits and giggles. Your best bet's to just run out this way and then come back in. You should get some sheep now. And corral them in. That's a nice spot there for them. And a whole bunch more will come, don't worry. So we're getting lots of stuff here. I think he's pushing that one. Okay, that was shitty. Where's the rest of my fucking sheep? Oh, one on each side of them. Well, I've got the skinny angle here. Man. Here they come.
So like I say, this, there's going to be some dicking around here, but we're leveling up. So there's three. Like I say, if you get all those, all of them in two rounds, you should be pretty good. I flinched. Oh, man. But we're going to be really good at the bow by the time we're done fighting with K-Pon. And we're going to be able to use K-Pon's bow as soon as he gives it to us. And we're getting some perks here. He's down. So a couple more, we should be okay. Remember, just stay away from the road and don't shoot them towards the road. And there's a very slim chance you'll get caught. I'm giving you a zero chance. Fucker. But if I go out too much further, I could get caught. And I am sucking, guys. I'm sorry. Hard on the skinny angle. You can even take out Buddy's dog if you want. But that's a harder shot. But I'm gonna do it just for the fucking shits and giggles. Oh man, that was about as close as I could get and not hit him. He's like, I'm okay with that. Okay. Nobody's alive here. Oh yeah, we got one. So let's get another arrow up here. Give him a 150 right in the ass. He died just as I was shooting him. That'll actually be good enough. Actually, how close are we? And let's get rid of these strength. We're going to take mule, so now we can carry more shit. That's always, to me, the most important one. The other one seems so tempting. Thick-blooded, so you bleed less. And let's go here and go to combat and check your bow and hit Q. And you know what? We might get another crop of sheep. I just don't want to not be at four when we need it. Yeah. So this will be quick, guys. I Trust me, it's going to be worth it, you'll see. If you can get to four, I can get us to seven pretty quick. But we need to be at four so we can buy the upgrade. We can buy the first upgrade, and that'll take us to five, and at five we can do the next one, which is six, and then we can do the ten also when we drink the Bowman Spree. Come on, guys. And you can do this all day if you want. We don't need too many, so. Use the 110s. The dog's back, too. I want to see if Kunash gets resurrected later in the game, if he's back around. But I don't think so. I think once you kill him, he's dead. There we go. That's all it took. So now you got a couple things to do. The first thing you want to do is take your helmet off. So you don't forget. Because when we're doing the Bernard yeah. training, you don't want to be looking through your fucking helmet the whole time. Make sure you bring your horse in. Not in and out. Like just once straight in. Just leave her anywhere. Yeah. Good day to you. Basic training. For training. And that'll yeah. be me. And let's start with the first training over again. So let's see what you're made of. Hold it properly and keep moving. Never stand still when your life depends on it. So just go around them three times, just like scallops. 
three. A little pass from the back. Right, he likes good. that. Now try attacking. You've got to put your back into a good slash. No use waving the sword around like you're swatting flies. Go into the attack with your whole body. Right. Try slashing from various sides to get used to it. Nice. All right. Nice. Well done. Well done. That pointy tip isn't for decoration. Try stabbing me with it a few times. Nice. That's a connect account. Right, that's it. All right. That will do. Slashing, stabbing, and movement are the foundations that you build everything else on. Now, let's try something more complicated. One strike, I can simply fend off. You mustn't give your opponent time to react. String your strikes together. As soon as you finish one, begin another. Strike, strike, strike. Okay, come on in. So what you want to do is you want to pin them in here. And then just give her. I don't have all day, boy. And this is going to be worth it, guys. We're going to be 20 minutes here worth of leveling up stuff. So don't... Uh, is this is your best place to level up. Holy Spirit? I told you not to do it in Scallets and all those other places, and this is why. You're going to spend time, do it all in 20 minutes, and get her all out of, out of your system. Let's go! And I charge up about three quarters is where I get the, the most bang for my buck. What's going on? Sudden visitation from the Holy Spirit or the Holy Ghost. Move quickly. And just keep on keeping on, guys. You're gonna see the level up start popping up here soon. I don't have all day, boy. Well we don't either. Warfare. Let's go. He will give up. So unfortunately, you can't go as long as you want. So try to get the most out of it you can. Let's go. I can even move my horse in a bit more, but it doesn't matter. We're, we're nailing them. I like to hear that sound, this, the metal sound. Let's go. I don't know if we're getting mounted combat, though. But he'll give you a, a couple minutes, like about three minutes worth of hits. What are you waiting for? There's agility. Strength. Like I say, when we're done this, we'll be able to handle Capon's bow. I don't have all day, boy. And, and beyond. It won't be long and we'll be using the 62. There's another sword. Oh, quickly. And I don't know, I just stumbled on this once. So I didn't What's see anybody else on? doing it, so hopefully you you can take this trick to the bank. Because if you're going to spend any time leveling up, this is it. And I've got some other stuff in this day, episode, boy. too, so don't go anywhere. It seems a bit boring, but the payoff is huge. Like what the money, or the money. For? The time you spend here, you're going to get back twofold, threefold. When you're fighting anyone, you'll be awesome. Let's go. So he's going to give up pretty soon. Visitation by the Holy Spirit? It is. And it's so easy, too. Just sitting on your horse. He can't go anywhere. He's pinned there. That's it. Now let's see how you do with defense. It's not hard to block a basic strike. Just watch out and move your sword into the path of the blow. <laughs> Just hold your cue. Good. Good. Your, your horse can't run away here either. So it's kind of made for it, if you ask me. I think if you don't do this, you're you're just ripping yourself off. Not bad. Very well, then. Let's see what you're made of, lad. Come at me and don't hold back. So you can't get on your horse here because he'll hit you and knock you off your horse. And you're just wasting your time. Good strike. You're best off to get the shit kicked out of you. And if you want to do it the fastest, get your back against the wall. And then he can get at you quicker. Uh. 
Yeah, I know it's not a wall, guys. It's a fence. Put your back against the fence. I don't really know if that works, but it seems to work for me. Oh, I got you, bro. So he's just showcasing all the moves you can learn. So the sooner you get your ass kicked, the better. That's what you call paying your dues. Okay, bro. Bro, I'm done. Fine. That's enough. I had my work cut out, it seems. That's life. Let's try something more advanced. When in combat, keep an eye on the space between you and your opponent. That is your space. Try to attack from the side the opponent will find harder to block in time. If I'm holding the sword raised up, do an uppercut. If my sword is low, lunge. Let's okay. try it. You strike a few times at the side where I'm not holding my sword. Okay, you just snuggle in. Oh, no, don't come out. Yep, snuggle in. Snuggle in. All right, not bad. Not bad. We need to snuggle in. There we are. Very good. Oh, yeah, there's right. only five Lesson here, but two. you're Everything ready anyways. Everything you've learned about blocking is wrong. When I cover, I can simply fend off your blows with my sword and gain control of the space between us. But it's better not to control just the space, but actually your opponent's weapon. Attack, and I'll show you. Okay, you show me. Oh, yeah, you're really doing good there, bro. Yeah, you're, you're showing me. What's you're showing on? me. You're showing me. I'm I'm learning. So he's helpless. What's going on? He's trying to sneak out a bit, so he's gonna snuggle back in there. What's going on? Let's go. Yeah, he's snuggled back in. Sudden visitation from the Holy Spirit. Oh, quickly. What is it? Sudden visitation <laughs> by the Holy Spirit? That's what it is. Well, you're showing me how to block a attack or something. So there's another What's strength. Going on? So do not, guys, skip this. This is your best. And there's, there's no punishment or penalty for not doing it right. He says you weren't too bad. Because you beat the living snot out of him, really. Look at He's going to have a headache for a week. Warfare. Like, we're jacking everything up. I don't have all day, boy. There's warfare, sword, strength, agility. All these things we're jacking up. What is it? Sudden visitation by the Holy Spirit? That's what it is. There's another sword. I think we get about four of each. What are you waiting for? I am. So to me, this is this is the best spot to be. What's going on? And it's pretty early in the game, so they don't expect you to be this jacked up when you start playing. Because uh, they weren't Stop expecting you to have a horse here. So I don't think anybody really tested this out and said, "Hey, you can kind of like level up here if you have a horse." So in all this stuff, guys, I discovered on my own. So I've never seen anybody else do any of the stuff I'm doing in, in this episode. On? All right, that will do. Oh, he's now just about you. to get it. The trick is to stay in your stance. As soon as I start to attack, you block. The move knocks the blade. This one you can off. do right through the horse. Just wait for the green. Ow! Good. But you may as well get out well from done. the horse. 
Because you got a bunch more coming. Ah, that's it. Ah, that's it. That's it. How do you like your steaks, there, uh, Bernard? Good. Right. You like, now you like we'll try some it a little faster. Concentrate and block just at the moment I start attacking. I'll strike you from above each time so you can see it well. I thought you liked them well done. Well done. There you go. Ah, uh, that's it. That's how he likes them. That's it. Well done. Good. They taste good. Nice. Nice and good. Now watch it. He might throw in an extra. He likes oh. to do that. And you can't block well done. it. Nope. Good, good. So this one, as soon as he cocks his sword back, that's when you do it. Succeed, but that's normal it's the cock. Watch. Train. Let's go. Cock. Ah. Cock. 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 Still worked. Cock. 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 Oh, we got defense too. Bernard. Captain Bernard. Cock. Wait a minute. Wait a while, Henry. You wait a while. I'm talking to the dude. Hey, dude, what's up? The coupon, our tip, our capon. I'm talking to the fucking dude. Yeah. Not the same as Where'd he go? Hammer, is it, blacksmith? It's Sir Radzig's orders. What? I know. I'm actually here to train at the archery range. My hands grown heavy. Lately. His hands grown heavy from you, you know. Mind, do you, Bernard? His hands grown heavy. Where are you? Good day to you, blacksmith's boy. Try not to hurt yourself. Where did we finish? Yeah. Yeah. Leading the opponent where you want him. One more way to evade a strike. Yeah. You simply step aside. You simply Attack. step aside. I'll show you. Okay. Come on in. And then simply. He's going to simply step aside. That's it, right? You just simply step Boom. aside. Quickly. Simply step aside. It's simple. Just step aside. Simply step aside. Bernard. What's going on? You are a horrible teacher. Simply step aside. Bruh. Simply step aside. Nope. He's not going to do it. Move quickly. Simply step aside, Bernard. You said it. It's simple. Simply step aside. What is it? Sudden visitation by the Holy Spirit? Dude, your lines is getting tired. You're getting your ass kicked. That's all there is to it. Snuggle him in a bit tighter. Move quickly. That's the sound we like to hear. So we got lots more shit coming, don't worry. Bernard, simply step aside, bro. That's what you said. Step aside. Oh, sorry, you're wedged in there? You can't step aside? What's going on? You're pinned? There's another sword. Extra one here. So we got what a few more it? rounds. Sudden visitation by the Holy Spirit? The last one's the funniest one. His talking. Look at that. Guys, we are jacking it up. Let's go. You go, girl. Guys, I think we're going to have to smoke a bowl here. Day, Need to smoke a bowl. Need to smoke a bowl. I'm going to try to puff a bowl in between the next charge up. Ready? Two, one, go. What are you waiting for? That was pretty good. Pretty good cough there, guys. I had to shut down my cough. On? It was a pretty good bowl. Okay. Almost forgot what I was doing there, Bernard. 
what's you're going simp on? simply stepping aside. Step aside, bro. It's what you said. Bernard, you suck. You suck wet monkey balls, bro. I'll show you how to do it. All right, try it. Yeah. Uh -oh. It's important not to move too soon. I'll see where you're going and hit you. That the same will happen if you move too late. I'll attack slowly now. As you see me, raise the weapon, jump us on. I'll show you how to do it, bro. Pull it off a bit, and there's your chance. You were doing it all wrong. Look at back. See? Well done. To the right. All right. Yep, to the left. Look at before you even started. Good. Fine. Now try it a little quicker. Try and get used to the rhythm. Never take your eyes off your opponent. You'll see a strike before it's even properly started. Left. Before it started. See? Not bad. Right. Oh, you tried a double whammy. And I still got you. Back. You're done. Bro. Nice. Oh, you're going to throw in a bonus round? That's it. Dude, that's a lot. That was four. Five. And the last thing for today. A trick. A trick. You raise the sword to force your opponent to block. I'll but show you a fucking trick. the direction of the attack at the last moment, and the opponent won't even know what hit him. Try it. Draw back the weapon. Get over change here. Change the attack zone and strike. Oh, I don't I'll have time to react. Fucking change the attack zone. Let's go. Let's go, dude. Wasting a lot of my time here. Okay, let's snuggle him in. Snuggle in. Let's like go. a Bernard in a rug. There. No, no, that's wrong. Oh, wrong. wrong, that's not it. No, that's wrong. Wrong, no. That's no. the funny one. No, not like that. No, that's not it. That's you sure? Because it feels like it. Like if I'm feeling it. No, not like no. I'm rocking it. I'm feeling like, it. No, I'm not giving like, it. No, I get wrong. 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 Bernard, I am I delivering. It. I'm delivering the goods, bro. You can't deny that. No. I, wrong. No, so those are all the no, ones you can do. Wrong, wrong, this is our last no, one. No, that's, no, we should get a no, couple more again. levels of something out of this. It's hard to keep count because there's just so much wrong, leveling going on. Wrong, wrong, there's another wrong, sword. Again, so I think that's four swords. No and then. No and then. Wrong, wrong. Hopefully not, we'll get a couple not, more no, somethings out of this. Wrong. No, I, not like wrong. Yep, there's an agility. That's good that's for our bow. It. Strength's the one that we're going to be not, a little behind on, but we have like, the two no, Hercules books not, we can not, read. Not like, not like, no. I know I said wrong. to read stolen no, books first, but no, sometimes we got to go with no, what we need. Again. No and then. No, wrong. No, that's, we could no, read the... Um, no. No, no, Shadow play, that's no, for stealth. Wrong, damn it. Not like that. So we're not going to get too much more out of him. Hopefully we can level something up. Wrong. No. Not like. No. No. I, no. That's, Warfare. No, I get wrong. Wrong. No, that's not it. No, it is it. Trust me, bro. It's totally it. No, that's You're doing wrong. a huge service it's to the community like, here. No. I, wrong. Wrong. No. I get wrong. Hopefully we can get Again. maybe two more, if we're lucky. Two more swipes at the can. Wrong. And there's no. another strength. That's no. what we need that's that. Wrong. No. I, wrong. Yeah. Wrong. No. That's, no. The easiest level no. points you'll ever get, guys. He is Again. pissed. Okay, this will be it. No, I can feel it. Not like wrong. I can tell when he's had enough of a shit no, kicking. No, no, wrong. But no, he might be feeling good today. Like wrong, damn it. Oh, we might get another one in here. Thanks, bro. No, 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 no. I, not like wrong, damn it. So there's, there's so that's it. All right. You're not completely useless. But turning See? you into a proper combatant will take a lot of training and practice. It sure will. Whenever you've got the time and the mood for it, come and see me and we can train together. Maybe okay. I can teach you something more. Thanks, bro. It doesn't work too good on the other training. Don't leave yet. 
So I had a lot of problems. Me to teach you archery. Come with me. Okay, so what we want to do first is go take a look at what the hell. Look at this, guys. So for warfare, we're going to take blood ladder so they bleed easier. And then for sword, I don't care. I always take the highest one. We have to go learn combos to use them. And then over here, we've got main level. And what we're going to take is um, savage I usually take. So in the wild, I have more strength, agility, vitality. Uh, strength, we're going to take the next mule. I know the other ones are tempting, guys, but then you can still take headcracker. You can also go with clinch master. Clinch master is great, but headcracker puts them right out. So it's nice to have that. I haven't got the headcracker to work once when I was fighting Capon Featherweight, so you take less damage from falls, and that's what we've been waiting for with the horse. So when we jump over something and we land, we don't get as hurt anymore. And also any falls. And if you want to increase that, you can drink an Aqua Vitalis. And you can double your ability to take falls. And it also heals you faster. So you can't you can kind of do the horse here, but you don't want to. You can ride it in, but it goes to the blank cut screen here. Save this. Okay, now so Capon's Cape, oh, easy exactly to beat. The of a knife, easy. Come in very handy. You've got Look at the shitter, guys. At you from a distance. You shoot one in the eye, drop your oh, right in their ass. Shit stain down the wall, and it splatters out here. Must just reek. Hey, Capon. Don't shoot them. Or that guy up there. Listen to Capon. Cut me up. Fella seems a little short sighted. I think I bullseyed it, and he said I missed. No jerky movement. Just let the string slide out of your fingers. As if you were so if you miss if you your target every time, he'll say that was horrible, Bernard. But if you do good, he'll actually, so he knows how good your training was. Not surprised the girl had to save your ass. There it was. Wouldn't you rather try shooting at a barn door? That was three capon and right into the bullseye. Well, that was that was what awful. Calm down, boy. Brother. So he challenges me to a bow down. So you can hit twos and beat them. You can hit ones and beat them. The highest he's ever got, I think, is like nine. But if you're done before him, you'll get an extra three points. If he beats you, he'll get three points. So you want to beat him. I think the highest you can get is 24. So I, I got two twos and all the rest were threes. He's done. Like I said, the highest... I, I think he's got higher a couple times. But he's usually no higher than nine. I've seen him get three. But he's got a heavy hand, remember? Well, From spanking I didn't it? didn't expect that. Probably just wasn't your day, sir. I told you I have a heavy hand. So now he challenges a sword fight. And he once again, he's equally as easy to beat because you're a lot tougher now. So just let him come in and do a block first with your Q. And then just jab him. <laughs> Cause you'll be tough enough now you can kick his ass he's no match for you see what i mean that's because we leveled up you got the better of me this time blacksmith must be having an off day are you all right sir because remember they, they thought you just started the game so there's capon's bow and i'll show you put it on q we can already handle capon's bow we can handle much more than that actually um skills or what's our stats? Our strength is 9. And our agility is 6. And that's what the bows are rated on. So talk to Bernard. Hmm. He says he shouldn't have pissed him off. Or he's going to be pissed. And then I, I said, hope oh. he has. Or I hope he is pissed off or whatever. Watch it, boy. So anyways, get your horse. And now you're riding. Yeah. Now keep in mind we're looking for Baron still. And if you want to repair a saddle, it's down here at the cobbler. 
That's the cobbler right there. But you have to take the saddle off the horse and put it on you. That wasn't barren either. Yeah. So we're supposed to go down and see the bailiff. And I don't see. But we'll see him, don't worry. Oh, this might this is him right here. Or is it the guy with the cap? Yeah, it's the wrong guy. It's a barren wannabe. So you're not in any big hurry to find Baron. We've got to walk around the whole town. We're going to find him. So don't go out of your way. We've already looked after Kunash. He's got to be sitting comfy. Good health. That's just the first one. Yep. Join the video so you can rely on me. Hands challenge me. And then that's it. You're out of there. Farewell. Now go in here. This is prime time for this job. Come over hey, here. Don't worry, just go. If you hustle, you're good. Here he comes. You're right there. So what you want to do now is just read all your books that you just stole. Because we don't need them. And they're all just one pagers. And just read them all real quick. This one we already had. Read. A couple of them are ones we've already read. Oh, you can't read that one. That's a full reader. If it has the bookmark on it, we've talked about this. And these are all just freebies. Last time we paid a thousand bucks for less. And then just drop them all on the fucking street. Sort by price, you can get them a little bit closer together. And then just drop them. So anything you read, you don't want to carry stolen books anyways. But I can show you how to ditch stuff if, if you get caught by the guy. If he wants to see your stolen stuff. Hopefully it'll happen. So I can show you. We have that book on us. And just put the books down. There's a whole pile of them there. And just give them to people. Sharing the gift of learning, guys. Help yourself, bro. They're not stolen, by the way. Okay, so now we're supposed to go see, we'll go get our kit, but if you can get your fucking horse over here, what are you doing? Now that you've joined the king's service, I'm having a hell of a time with the horse, then you can start training with the huntsman up here. But until this point, he wouldn't train you. So now that you're level four, what you're going to do is you're going to drink a Bowman's Brew. And we can repair our saddle now, actually. So go to your Bowman's Brew. You only need one of those bitches. Inventory, food, and drink it. So now that takes our our Bowman ship up five points. Good health to you, sir. So now we're at four. Do the training. Can buy that. And that'll put you to five. And now at five, you can train the five. Can you teach me? And now we've got the buff on from the potion, so we can train the level ten. And we've only got one left. Sorry. Can you teach me? And there you go. Now pay close attention. So now we're level seven, and then you can talk to him again. And train hunting. You can train again. You may as well. Anything you train will rise up your main level. Can you help so even though we're not going to have the hound, we'll still train it. And then go back to him and get his work. So he's going to tell you about um, nightingale birds. 
Fine. So here's the problem. My friend is a birder, and he left a few rare nightingales with me for safe. They're good. To he lost them, and I gotta go find them. I want me to find them. So he'll give you the cages, and it's just another side quest. But we'll take it now, and then talk trade. And you can buy his map, even though we've already got it. I like to have all the maps, and it's reading too. And if you want any extra stuff, you can buy it here. He's got great arrows, like the 150s. They're 14 bucks an arrow. But we're not going to do that. Check basket close to you. That's all you need. Get away from the horse, bro. Now let's go get our kit. Still watching for Baron. Get through there. And there should be a guy here. If there's not, you gotta wait for him. There's two. I'm gonna guess it's him. Told to pick up. There you go. And now you can go in here and go to weapons, and he can have that piece of shit. And he can have that piece of shit. You can put those back on. He can have that piece of shit. This is the stuff they gave you. Put my helmet back on so I look cool. Drop that piece of shit and drop those pieces of shit. There's your crap plus an extra piece. Go fuck yourself. If you didn't do it, it'd say that you failed to pick it up. But you don't need it to impress Nightingale. Not to be mistaken with the Nightingale quest that we're going on. And guys, we're going to rob Nightingale tonight. We're going to take all his shit, take his dice, take everything. Pull out your Bowinski. Get an extra 85 bucks. We're going to need a fucking arrow. But of course you won't get 85 bucks for it. You'll probably get like 25 and tell him you're here to... Oh, make sure Baron's not here. There he is. See, good, good call. Okay, I'll have something yours. Have something. And give him the money and the goblet. You'll get a double rep. And then you can just do a quick Yahoo with these. Just for the speech. Goodbye. And that's it. We're good to go. Hey, nighty night. Here I am. I ready to get go. That's me. And if you want the extra reputation, say I want to be useful. Okay, let's go white and pale. This I mean, tight and stale. I mean, nightingale. Yeah, it's a nice church. Needs a little stucco work, dude. I'll get to that on the weekend. So we can do a lot of things while we're on this run. But you can't get too far away from him. Or he'll stop. Clean up. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We got one of these ones. Okay, we're good. Yeah, it's big. Willie starts moving. She's got a whole bunch. So she's a good one to talk to. But don't let him get too far away. I'm coming, bro. She can talk to this guy. Good day to you. You only have a couple, probably. Good luck to you. Yeah, uh-huh. That's um What do you want? Antonia. God bless. What the hell is going on here now? If you talk to him quick, you can train with him. What do you need? Can you show me how Okay, now do your thing with him. Let's talk to him again. What are you two about this? Look at us. Beggar thinks. My name is Jane. My name is Stacy. No one cares what your name That's not is. my name. This filthy beggar thinks she can. Okay, so say so call yourself Christian Armor, you and then tell him to give her money because we didn't make all what? this money to give away, bro. Give away your money. He'll hate you now. That I can tell you. But you act. What like do you want? Christian. How does? Go fuck yourself, Jane. Oh, one question, that's it? After all I did for you? Nightingale. It's dinner for the family. Help yourself. So try not to get in his way. Or he'll stop. 
Well, see, she had a lot of the same questions as the other girl. Usually there's somebody here you can talk to. You can't talk to the guards. They don't, they don't want to talk to you. Oh, yeah, coupon. Let's have a sleep. First to Moravia, Grab your dinner there, bro. You missed it. Here. Is managing the Help yourself. Until Sir Hans comes of age. Gotta have a dump. There, Knight and Sale. Knight and White and Pale. A nightingale. You learn Bertie Yon K. Yon Bertie Yes K. He was telling us about it. We didn't listen. Puppy! Puppy! Yeah, he doesn't like you, Nightingale. He liked me. Because I have that animal magnetism, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. He doesn't know what I'm saying. He has no idea. Where I went is about as far away as you want to go. And don't stop someone in his path or he'll just stand there. It looks much better during the markets. Then it's filled to bursting. Good health to you. Yeah, it's filled to bursting. Oh, he's got a whole shitload. Oh, good. We didn't want to lose him. Come on, let's go, bro. Step into it. Double time. Oh, we got someone we can talk to. Bro? My respect. But Rate, oh, he's got a whole host of shit for us. Oh, he's waiting for me. Fuck. I went too far. I may as well get the speech, though. I've committed myself this much. Let's go, bro. That wasn't too bad. He does? He said the baker's daughter has nice, you know? Look here. It's he buns, dude. It's bed. buns. Yeah, I see him. Look out. Good day. So get the speech while he's fucking around there. And if you interrupt, it'll stop him. There's one ale Good house here on the market. Can you get this too? The others up by the gate. Be with you. We'll be going there later. Saved your ass, bro. How you doing? So far, so good. Let's move along. Sometimes I'll wait and do the training here, but he has to, he'll stop. Like, you won't be able to do all that training in one foul swoop without him stopping. But either way, it takes about as long. That's why I do it on the horse. Okay, once he gets past the stairs. Give her. Um, let's talk. Oh, always. Oh, that was close. Let's talk trade. And then buy his book. That's all I want. Chuck basket close to you. Didn't miss a beat. Can't stop these girls or he'll stop. Don't you fret. There's no rush. How you doing, ladies? See, anybody gets in his way. I don't know if I'll have enough time to talk to her. What do you want? He's stopping for the other guy. What's life? See, he's gone. We're good. We just gotta catch up to him. May the Lord watch over you. What? She, she doesn't like me too much. By the book. He has the same book. I'm pretty sure. Let's double check. Good day to you. Because they're working out of the same till. Yep. You can play dice too if you want. Which is a dumb thing to do. But I tested that once. He'll wait for you. Rate fiefdom is pretty big. 
Naturally, it starts here by the town and continues along the Sasau River all the way to Kohelnik. Dude, you missed your dinner. Here you go. Gallows Hill, lots of farmhouses. Last shot at around. it. No pun intended. Neuhof, Merhoyed. Yep. Master Smill is in charge of Sir Hanush's stables. He's Smales? by far his best vassal. Judge it's Smales? complicated for a newcomer, I suppose. This lord here, that lord there, this exemption Guy's here, always that right there. Exemptions from exemptions, rights to half of something, so on. It took you a year to make head or tail of it. Scared him. This tower was only half the size when I was a young lad. Sir Hanush had it extended and made it's into a armory. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice, dude. Bro, got any, got any weed? My respects to you. What kind? Good Is he stopping? Here. Nope. Didn't miss a beat. Here's dinner. Right here, bro. I can carve that bitch up right now for you. I got a stinger. So we got more refugees you can talk to. Nope. See, we're getting almost done. Because out of all of them, they eventually share a lot of the dialogue. And you'll, you'll get them all by getting a few. Take care now. It's quiet today. It's quiet. Good. Good. Where's Moimir anyway? Yeah, where is he? Uh, yes. He hasn't turned up yet. Hasn't turned up. Oh, I see. He sees. Now where might he have got to then? Where? I don't know. He doesn't know. You don't know, eh? He, he doesn't know. Let me tell you something. Said he doesn't know. When the bailiff finds out Moimir's slacking off, he'll be in serious shit. Shit, bro. And being a friend of his, you wouldn't want that, would you? No. You look like the squealing type. A bitch. Ask him. So it's better if I deal with it and we leave the bailiff out of it, right? Right, squealer? Um, yes, I suppose so. Yep. So where is he? He's a bitch. In the tavern. Squealing on his buddy. Went for a nail. Dude, give up. Come on, Henry. Yeah. Go and find that idler. Yeah. You'd better talk some sense into him. I'll be telling him who squealed on him. Let's go. Wouldn't squeal on you, bro. Don't worry. So you want to move in here quick? Talk to Browinski. Oh no, wrong guy. Talk to her. And hurry up. Whoa. You can buy her book. Tavern life. Check basket. We could have got that in scallops too, by the way. Well, she just went through the ground. What kind of... She went really low. I can't see her feet right now. Shit. No, it's, I'm up on the bench. I went high. Let's have a drink. Okay. We got this, guys. We've got the six dice. This is our moment to shine. We want to stand up for this one. got me all worked up. Me too. Me as well, the lazy bastard. My words exactly. And just when we need every listen. This is our shining listen moment, guys. Anyway. How about a little game? Oh yeah. He always beats me. Why not? But not today. One time he got me with one roll. He rolled three times in one. So here's what we want, guys. This is what I collected them for. Just this shining moment. Now just keep clicking on the bottom one till you have all six and just hit escape. I can't wait to see how you throw. I can't either because I've got these dice finally. So you can just take the, the 300 and run, but I'm just going to take one right now and re-roll. So you want ones or fives or three of a kind or one, two, three, four. So I just take the one because that's my only fucking choice and roll again. These are supposed to be odd dice. I got a couple ones right there. Is that three ones? No. One, one. So I'm just going to take the one and the five because it's getting pretty skimpy and hit Q and you're out of there. It's the same. Fucking... Well, before I had 300, I got 350. And now watch him. Guys, watch. Mm-hmm. Should I? Shouldn't I? Yeah. 800, no, guys. I did. 800. So it's one, two, three. Oh, if that was a four, we'd be fucking gold. Take the one and we'll re-roll. Looks like we got some ones. Oh, man, I don't know what to do. I'll take the one and hope for another roll. I gotta do it. That's two ones. I can see them. 
And that's it. That's all I'm going to get. I still haven't even caught his first roll. Watch him go. You ready? It's exactly what I'm saying. Mm. Like, how come okay. I don't get those? Okay, one, two, three. It's worth a hundred. The five's only worth fifty. Fuck. Guys, I'm not gonna chance it. He's gonna win right here. Watch. He's gonna get eight fifty. I'll have a beer. Or seven fifty, sorry. So there's one, two, three, fifty, four fifty. Or 350. No yeah. hey, uh, so he's giving me one chance. I got to get 950 here. Or I'm fucking done. Oh, got it. That's a thousand points. Just get the hell out of there. I beat you, dude. I did it. Fucked. I did it. I fucking finally beat you. Yep. I'm still well, robbing you, though. Done for the night. Isn't it We're robbing him tonight, See, guys. If you wouldn't. I'll do that. Before I forget. We never repaired the saddle. But you know, there's really no difference to the saddle. Is he still open? Because you got to ring the bell to shut everything down. Oh, motherfucker. So it doesn't matter. But I was going to do that, yeah. I forgot. Just run people over, it don't matter. I find with Warhorse Yenda, when you really get up there in speed and everything, you can kill people. Just by running them over. You'll come back to town and wonder why they're throwing you in jail, and that's why I fucking killed somebody. No, no, no. Yeah. And this is your chance to kick Capon's ass again. Because they're, once again, they're not expecting you to be as tough as we are. I tried to pull her right in. And the cannon of St. Wenceslas in... So let's just get to the fight. Best way to beat anybody is back up. Hit Stop right it. and then push forward. Hit right. I got on my horse and drove away before. But it resets. Ready? Hit forward and push right. Once he gets against something, he'll beat me. Not now. Once you got him in this... And then we get in shit from Hanish. What in the name of Christ is happening? So make sure whatever you do, you put your damn torch on. This, that's a, a must for this this thing we're gonna do here. Something you're looking for here? No, I'm not looking for anything there. So head in here. Close the door. No one lives here. So it's always free game. I can't get up there either. And you can get some lock picking here. We don't want any of that crap. We really just want the points and we'll get a very easy here. I think that was a hard. I didn't check. And then an easy. So now this is your timeshare condo. I've reserved it for you, so anytime you want. Grab something to eat, too, if you want. Have a seat ski. And then what you're going to do first is take off all your armor. Because we are going to rob Nightingale tonight. But it's not late enough yet. So what you want to do is kill some time your best thing is to read a book and read Hercules and his diet too and then this one will give us enough that we'll get a strength perk or a main level perk I think well we get a perk and it's gonna allow us to buy brute I think it is main level so then you come back here and on main level 
take brute. And what you're going to get out of this is a plus two on strength and a minus one charisma on panel or penalty on charisma. So take that bitch down here for reading. Take in the flow. So you get tired and hungry half as fast. And then you're ready to rock. So this is a risky, risky mission. I don't know why my torch isn't on. Because they'll come from across the fucking map to get you. Come from the other side of the friggin' castle. That moon looks pretty cool. So if you want to know where Nightingale is, he lives across from the bakery here where the wagon is. So head over here. Only got one lockpick on me too, I think. Success. Okay, so wait a sec. Now this, this is risky because if you get caught, you'll get thrown in jail. And you really just got to go for it. So hopefully he's in here. He is. Knock him out quick as a bunny. Knock nighty night out. And we'll take it. Just take everything. Let's get the hell out of here. And that's as easy as that. If he's in the front room, there's three of them. It's a little more risky, but you just got to go for it. If you get caught, it'll start you again right where you finish fighting with Capon, where you go up to the house here and read your book. So maybe save before you go in. Just drink a save your schnapps. And that way, if, you, if something goes wrong, you can just restart it. But we're going to sort out the goods when we get up here. Can't sprint. Close the door so no one can see you. I head over here. And then go to your inventory. And anything you don't want of his stolen shit, just throw it in the trunk. So we got the cross guard, which says this fine cross guard was engraved in Sasau, but there's never a quest for it. Put it in the chest. Take his fucking meat, put it in the chest. The only thing I want is his dice and that cross guard. Lucky playing dice. You don't need all his shit. Keeping that. You can have that back. You can have his smoke, so I'm going to drop that. I can't. And I don't need his torch. And his unpopular dice. So he had a couple dice. And that's it. Now you got Hercules and his die at one. In your inventory, we're almost to level 10. So... Stats, strength, level 9, plus 2, 10, 11. So we're good. Now just hit the sack. Did, and did I put both books on? Just got to make sure. No, I didn't. I would have been reading Tavern Life. So if you want to make sure you're reading the book you want, and you can also, that's that counts as reading. Look at that. Leveled up just on the map. So we don't need that. And we go back to Sidekick. And just put on the book you want to read. And make sure you're able to read it too. And then hit the sack. And you want to get up around 5.30. 5.15, right there where the gold circle is. I told you to clear off. And, I and that's not all. You should have thought twice of yeah, he, he he's pissed off. Damn it! Here's but he never caught you. us. You've paid for your crime. We paid for his shit, basically. Now get the hell out of here. That happened to me last time too. He caught me in the morning. But there's nothing he can do because I don't have any stolen shit. But did he take this my other stuff? 
Nope. He didn't take anything. Yeah. Yeah. How you doing there, coupon? So tell me you want to go hunting. Here I am. I'm overjoyed. Have you got a horse? Yes. Really? What is it? A cart horse? Actually, Happens to be the fastest horse in the entire kingdom, by the way. Huh. Yeah. So I actually think we need some more food. Okay. So don't take your horse. And wash up if you want. Oh yeah, we're good. He hurt me. Look at that. What a bitch. So having your horse won't make it any faster. Trust me on this. I'm going to show you the quickest fast travel spot you can get to. So follow him back about here. You don't want to be so close that he's talking to you, but you don't want to be too far back. And that's why we leave at this time, so we can see the cool sunrise effect. That is pretty, pretty boss. Who's excited for Kingdom Come Deliverance 2? Or whatever it's going to be called. I guess the question is, who's not? Because if they did this with a small team and a limited budget, imagine what they're going to do with number two. It's probably going to be an Unreal 5, too. Or I don't know what this one was in. It's not Unreal either, is it? It's, um, fuck. Okay, so once you get to this post, speed up. Slow down, speed up. Slow down, speed up. There you go. That's about as soon as you can quick travel. Otherwise, you have to walk with him for a ways longer, past the big tree we were looking at. Doesn't matter what time you get here, it's 1900. You could have rode your horse, but that takes a long time too. And if you add it all up, it's not worth it because we can actually do some reading here. So it's a win-win if you don't ride the horse. We'll make camp here. So you got to get the shit out of this bag. And guys, we're going right to the baptism of fire. This is going to be a big episode. I'm trying to shave it down to about three hours. Because it usually takes three and a half, almost four hours for me to get there. We're waiting for him to sit down so we can get the bacon and wine. Coming up, sir. Oh, sorry. Give him the bacon. Sorry. Bacon, wine, and then hit X. So, are you enjoying being on the hunt? I am. That so it's a chance to bro down. So you'll get a couple reputation from him. Another one. And that's what? it. And then make sure you say all right, and you'll get another one, and that's it. Talk to him again, you get one more speech, but he tells you to wait till morning. So have a seat. And see if your book's finished. It's not, so read that. And then start reading some of your stolen stuff. We'll do the shadow play. Oh, it's not stolen anymore. We can't read that yet. So, um, Hercules is done. Let's do the horse riding. We're going to get the whole set of four. Oh. oh, it's on my horse. Sorry, guys. Duh. And I should have kept that open, so I'm really fucking up here.
And then what we want to do is get a bit of sleep. So we should be pretty high in the horse. High on the horse. In the horse level. So there's another perk. So what we want to take here. We've got strength. And we'll take... We can't take meal three. We'll take clinch master. And then for skills, horsemanship. We take strong thighs, so it's limited. There's almost no chance of getting knocked out of the saddle. And then we want to sleep for a bit. And fuck, did I make sure I had a book on me? I did it again. So I think that book's done. If you want to see if you can read a book, just go to your level. Horsemanship's level 7, so if we gussy our horse up, all we, have to, all we have to do is put on, now look at our horse was level 7, all we have to do is put on the spurs, and we get the plus 5. And that book, if it's only 10, we can read it. And I think it is. Oh, after level 15. Oh, that's 4. So let's read Shadow Play. We'll get some stealth. And just crank it. Capon will get you up. And that way we'll wake up and we'll be almost 100. We don't need food. He'll talk to us. What are you? And so we oh. challenge him to whoever gets the most hairs wins a hundred groschen. So get your bow on, Capon's bow, and let's go with some shitty arrows. <coughs> and head around. Night. All you have to do is find one rabbit. This can sometimes be a chore, and sometimes it's easy. It's just luck of, the, luck of the draw, guys. Just grab everything. Put your bow away. Head back down to the camp. The seat ski. And the horse riding's done. Shadow play, so read that. So we're really um, juicing up here. And then go back to your sidekick. Let's get shadow play too, because we should be definitely good for that by now. Oh, sorry. Let's see if we have any reading left in us. No. So then just pass time, and you'll still read, and you're going to the other side of the gold circle, right over here. Just hit escape. And we still read. So we've done a lot of reading. I didn't say we did. So maybe we can't read that book. I fucked up. How did that? <coughs> Your yep, and you get a hundred. You also got a hunting point, which is nothing. We'll do. I don't care. Antlers or tusks. And now he said they're gonna go hunting boar. So this is one time I'm Henry, gonna fail a quest on me. purpose. We're going hunting. And we're going somewhere. I don't know where it is now around here. And if you, you can ride with him, but if you don't, it'll say you failed talking to him. And it's not really detrimental to the operation. I forget where it is now. But if you nail it, it's pretty good. That's not it. 
back here somewhere. But it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Just go like this. Oh, sorry. Time. Just hit enter and then hit escape. And if you're not there, hit map. It'll show you where he is. So, see, we missed her by a fucking mile. I was pretty close, though, with my marking, and I, I couldn't remember that spot. Yeah! I was almost there. In fact, I think I drove right by it. I did. There'll be ball somewhere nearby. So, just like last time, slow and quiet. Whatever slow you and quiet, bro. Then, we'll yep. Out from the top like this? So there is a grave here we could have dug up, but there's nothing in it that I want. Maybe a pair of gloves or something. So he tries to hit hit the boar. I tell him you can't kill it. And he thought he did because it fell over, but then it got up and ran. So we're chasing it. If you have a horse, you get this scene. So now you might still be on your horse. Sometimes they start you on foot. Either way, you just want to turn around and run. And the problem is I don't have my shit loaded up. So let's go to weapons. Put on my sword. I got the bow and the arrow, but I want a better arrow. Not, I don't want to use the good ones. This is good enough. So go to this tree where you can hide from the archer behind it. And then this guy doesn't like this sword, the stinger. And you're tough as shit now. Watch out. Let's go behind the tree, pull out your bow, Winsky. How'd that feel, bro? Grab his bow. And we should be able to handle this bow right now. Human bow, done. Guys, we're already rocking a 62 bow. Put that on the horse, we'll sell it. That thing's a piece of junk, drop it. And keep capons in case you get hurt a bit, your strength will go down. And then just grab whatever you want, band-aids, cash, gloves. And he's got some good arrows, so you want those. You can also take the arrows in the tree. That's it. Take his ear. That's all we want from him. Let's go see Capon. So, so far pretty easy. That was our first real time we could have died. Take everything. In this one here, there's nothing in it, but let's get the points. I'm coming, tampon, or coupon, or capon. So his horse is dead, his dogs are dead. Let's have a look at you. Henry! Yep. What the fuck happened? You turned up uninvited at some cute... And you took them all. So Damn seems... right. God's holy britches. I never knew you had it in you, Henry. Oh, yeah. Remind... Ugh. Remind me never to get on the wrong side of you. There you I'm go. wound on your head doesn't look good. <sighs> Not to worry. Come along then, sir. So somehow we have to walk him back, even though I have a horse. It's and you saved his ass. And now they're going to take you into the into the army with the boys. And then we start. They actually give us a horse, but we already have one. And now we start on our first real mission. See, we failed to talk to Sir Hans Capon. I warned you of that, but don't worry. 
You can ride with them if you don't want to fail. How is it possible, Ratsy? Those bastards make so bold no more than a mile from the castle. Well, don't be so modest, young Henry. You showed not only courage, but loyalty to your liege. That's why I'm taking you into sorry, my personal interrupt, service. There you go. And just a little bit of extra advice, if you want, you put on your armor before you do the fight with those guys. If you're not feeling comfy. Off we go. The Neuhoff stud farm's been raped. It has. We don't know much about what... So get some training from him. Training. Uh, sword. Like Beginner. That's Boom. Like we can still do another one. I think we can do three now. We've really upped our sword. Oh, there you are. Can we go? If you don't have Ready time. So you get, that's where he's giving us a horse. Yes, yes sir. Now. If you don't have time, you can always do this training in Neuhoff. Sword. I'd like to improve. I mean, I do. Training. Sword. I'd like to improve. Sir. I'm sure. No, we're not there well, yet. I'll think. And ask him about the ears. And this uh, sounds like a bit of fun. So he'll give you money if for banded ears. Training. And do defense. And training. And do axe. I'd like to learn to. Hey, hold right there. Show me okay. what you have on. Okay, I'll show you how to do this. Okay, stop real quick. Now look for anything that you have that's stolen. Even on your horse, they'll take it off your horse too. So take that book. That's all we have, I think. Go back to your inventory, books, and just drop it. Now run back to him, and then talk to him. What's going on? Orders of his lordship. Search me then. Uh, hmm. All right, you can go. And now you're clear for a long time. They won't search you for a long time. Just make sure no one's looking. Just go grab your book again. Where'd it go? There. You're out. Now we might have missed them. So let's catch up to them. Yeah. And, and you want to go about here anyways and hit map. And now you can just quick travel. So actually, guys, I think I'm going to end this one. I don't want it to be too long so I can uh, put them up in 4K a little bit faster. They take too long when they're big. So this will be the end of part two. And come on back for part three.